In this video, I will show how to create this path following text in DaVinci Resolve. If you are new to this channel, then please subscribe. I have imported this roundabout road clip and I am in the fusion page. I will drag this clip into notes window. I will close the media pole to get better view of the viewer. I will add a text node and a merger node to merge it with the video clip. I am going to type DaVinci Resolve and decrease the size. Now the text is ready, I will try to move it along this path. To do so, I will select the text node and go to layout. Under the type drop down menu, I will select the path. As you can see, the cursor point has changed it to crosshair. As soon as I select the first point, new menu appears at the top with options to fine tune your path. I have selected my first point and now I will select the last point here. From the menu, I will select this insert modify option to add more points. I will add three points and move it to turning positions of the road. With the point selected, I will click on smooth to change it to a curve. I will do the same for these two points. I know it's not a perfect path, but I am happy with it for this demonstration. I will make sure that I am in the beginning frame and I will go back to text. I will drag this horizontal anchor or H anchor slider to the right until text goes out of the frame. As you can see, I am at the end of the slider, but it doesn't mean that it is the maximum you can move. You can manually enter the value to move it further. I will create a keyframe here. I will select frame 40 and create a keyframe again. Move the slider left to move the text to the other end of the path. Now that I have created keyframes, I will hit play to see how it is. Of course, you can always modify the path to fine tune it. You can also do the same thing with an image like a car, for example, which makes more sense moving on a road than a text. But you may have to add more keyframes in the middle to get the angles right. And also, you should work on composting to blend it with the video. If you think you learned something from this video, hit the like button to support and subscribe to get more videos like this.